Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Hello world, Mike Turner here, aka Racer Sims. Welcome to the Locker Gnome Daily Report, TLDR for short, your daily source of geek news, gadget views, and answers you just might be able to use. Like an answer to the question, what did Chris do with where to get good coffee.com that he registered in the hover domain name registration service video he did the other day? I decided to set up a web store to sell coffee mugs. Technically speaking, it's not where you could get good coffee, but you probably already have good coffee. If not, do you even care about coffee? The most interesting discovery came on the front page with this prescription coffee mug. Caffeine is a drug, and yes, I'm addicted. Where do you get good coffee? And don't just say the grocery store. Everybody, well, no, you probably don't get good coffee there. Then again, some people don't care what their coffee tastes like. And if not coffee, soda, or wine, or beer, name any beverage. And don't tell me you're just the type of person who enjoys water. And even if you don't drink coffee, I'm sure there's at least one beverage you enjoy, whether that's soda, beer, wine, juice. No? No? You, you just like drinking water? That's it? Fine. I don't know. I really, I genuinely do not know that much about you. And it's not like we're dating or anything. I mean, we've kind of got this weird relationship going on. I produce videos, you watch them, like them, and share them, hopefully. And if not, I would consider this relationship extremely dysfunctional. It's all take and no give! Although, I, I don't know who's taking and who's giving here. I can give you 10% off your next domain name registration on Hover.com if you use the coupon code LOCKERGNOME. Or perhaps you'd rather me give you a free Microsoft Outlook 2013 quick reference card. You can download that from the link in this video's description. Okay, okay, quick show of hands. How many of you actually read the video's descriptions? Please, tell me I'm not the only one. Something else you'll find in there? Directions for how to play Rock, Paper, Scissors, Lizard, Spock. It would be highly illogical for you not to look. If I was an enterprising app developer, and I'm not because I'm not even an app developer, I would figure out a way to create a cross-platform, network-enabled, multiplayer game up to five users to play Rock, Paper, Scissors, Lizard, Spock together. But I am an iPhone user, and we've just posted a 50% discount on the 8X zoom lens for iPhone 5 on deals.lockernome.com. And while you're there, be sure to sign up for our 13-inch MacBook Air giveaway. Or the 49% discount on how to design and build fully functioning iOS apps. I mean, I can't really imagine doing this for the rest of my life. I'd like to, but only with your support. A lawyer has blamed Apple for his porn addiction. Really? This is what the legal system is all about? Okay. I'm not joking. A lawyer really blamed Apple for his porn addiction. I mean, why Apple? Why not any other company? I mean, Apple, if any company, locks things down to the point where you can't get those apps in the App Store. Unless he was using a web browser, in which case... What? Dude, I'm not trying to slag on your addiction, but I don't think you should have made that public. But I suppose it's like the puppets from Avenue Q say, the internet is for porn. Every once in a while, Diana will hear me singing that song and she'll wonder why. Because it's catchy! Na 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 Hey, I never promised to be on tune. Apple looking into reported electrocution of iPhone 5 user in China. I hope to goodness that never happens to anybody, no matter which device they happen to use. Apple is reportedly signing Samsung for next-gen iPhone chips. I'm glad you two finally decided to get along, at least on one thing. And this just in from Diana, according to her, Seattle is the fifth whitest city in the nation. Only fifth? Really? Come on, Seattle. We gotta do better than that. I don't know if you have noticed this in the Perillo vlogs, but Diana's kind of looking about as white as I am. It's a bit, don't tell her, though. And she doesn't watch TLDR, so I'm not worried about her finding out that I actually said that. Don't tell her. Apple is also aggressively hiring for a smartwatch project. Well, that pretty much seals the deal. At some point in the future, we'll see an iWatch. I don't even know if Apple could convert me into someone who wears a watch on a regular basis. I, I just don't like the feel. I still have the pebble. I just don't wear it. I don't even like wearing rings. That's a tattoo. Kidding, kidding. It's not a tattoo. It's a real ring. I am never getting a tattoo. Microsoft has cut Surface tablet prices amid weak demand. That's right, the Surface RT is now available for $349. And just like I posted on social media as soon as I heard the news, they need to drop it maybe $200 more. To me, the Surface RT is worth 
for the hundred bucks. I'm not saying that the hardware is horrible, it's just that the hardware in conjunction with the software is not exactly a great experience. Mind you, we're talking about Surface RT, not Surface Pro. Two completely different pieces of hardware, two completely different operating systems. Okay, maybe not completely different operating systems and completely different hardware. Different hardware platforms, one's based on Intel, the other one on ARM, and the two operating systems, one running full-on Windows 8 and the other one Windows kinda? And if I was Microsoft, that's exactly how I would rename Windows RT to Windows kinda. Or Windows-ish. Carriers slash BlackBerry Z10 price down to 49 bucks. So that means they only have $49 to go to match the world's interest in the BlackBerry Z10. Did you catch that joke there? It's supposed to be funny. Unless, of course, you're a BlackBerry user, at which point you have my condolences. Google has decided to open the redesigned Google Maps experience to all, no invite required. And if you haven't seen the updated experience yet, it's worth it. Oh, and in case I didn't tell you today, I love you more than bacon. That was a sign you could purchase on Amazon.com. I linked to it in my social profiles on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, you know, places that aren't YouTube. And speaking of places that aren't YouTube, I hope you've downloaded the free Locker Nome app available for both iOS and Android, if only to participate in the polls. I'm about to ask the question, will you buy Apple's iWatch? To have your vote counted against the communities, all you need to do is participate in the app, which is free. The biggest reason to have the Locker Gnome app is for the push notifications. We will send you an update every time we upload a new video to this Locker Gnome YouTube channel. Our question of the day is brought to you by Audible. Go.tagjag.com slash Audible for a free 30-day trial plus one audiobook download for free. If you use my link, go.tagjag.com slash Audible to start listening to your next book. And this question was asked by Tarun. Does stopping push mail really save battery life? Anytime you use your device, it's going to drain battery. So yes, any feature you toggle that does something on the device is going to drain battery. By not using that feature, you're going to save the battery from being used. Newsflash, batteries drain. I say use your device, man, or woman. But I'm gonna go ahead and throw in a bonus question today asked by Matthew Taylor on Twitter. Chris Perillo, does Apple Keyboard work with Windows? Yes, Matthew, it does. I know plenty of people who use the Apple keyboard on Windows, and I've said it before, I'll say it again, it's one of my favorite keyboards of all time. The keys have great action, and that's all I want in a keyboard. No joke, I tend to type faster when I'm using an Apple keyboard. And that's not just because the keyboard's from Apple. I used Microsoft keyboards for years, and, and loved them, until I used an Apple keyboard. And whoever makes that product, uh, I would love it because it helps me type faster. Do you hear that? I'm happy with you. I'm also happy with you, so long as you remember to like, comment, and share the things we're doing for you with everybody else. Maybe those people are not in the same room with you right now. That's okay, because that's what the social media thing is all about. You know, you can share with people you know out there in the galaxy, beyond planet Earth. They're watching right now. Cool. I like that. We'll eat you later.